there's all sorts of regulations that have been created uh, by state and local governments to try to protect their police departments from competition by and large. Um, and those things have to be broken down. My name's Bruce Benson. I'm uh, an economist at Florida State University. I'm chair of the economics department. Essentially what it does is, is suggest that there's massive government failure in the area of law, um, creation of law, enforcement of law, uh, dispute resolution, all those sorts of things, and <clears throat> that uh, there are private alternatives that work much better uh, and in fact uh, would uh, create a more just uh, society, I think. Uh, while becoming more efficient <laughs> at the same time. The punishment for uh, abuses by public police are trivial compared to the uh, damages they can do to people. It, you, know, you can't sue the public police uh, for uh, making a mistake uh, like you could a private firm. Private individuals would be liable uh, for the consequences of their actions. Um, a competition uh, would be intense, um, but it's not going to be violent competition because that's expensive. If we were to move to privatization, uh, I, I will predict that there will be lots of new innovations that I never dreamed of, um, despite the fact that I've been studying these issues for uh, uh, a couple of decades now. In the United States, Historically, for instance, uh, people moved westward much faster than the government uh, did, and as they moved westward, they created their own communities voluntarily, recognized each other's uh, property, uh, formed uh, associations for protection, um, and uh, developed their own dispute resolution mechanisms uh, from the bottom up, even today. Uh, with public policing and public law enforcement. We see a market for private security, private uh, investigative services and things like that. Uh, imagine an insurance company, for instance, selling insurance against uh, uh, robbery and so on. Um, and uh, of course, they have to pay off then, but uh, if they have the right than to pursue the criminal and collect damages from the criminal, uh, they would invest in much more in, um, investigative services. We, we all read the paper and see uh, about police shooting somebody uh, who's innocent. Don't wait till it happens to you. So there's not a trade-off between uh, liberty and security. Uh, you can have both, uh, but you aren't going to get it through the government.